Hallo. So I was checking my time. Uh, should I say good morning or good a uh, good afternoon? So good morning. It's still time for afternoon. Um, I would start from the start. You know, um, I started thinking when I was this old that I would want to do something. You know, I always thought like how other girls would think of Barbie dolls or soft toys that time. And I would, you know, just switch on the TV and look at Bruce Lee, you know, uh, doing his karate thing, his moves. And, you know, I would practice it on my brother. He was so tiny, I used to hit him all the time. And my dad used to, you know, kya kar rahi hai yaar, maar degi bacche ko. But uh, I always thought something, you know, very different from others. I wanted to do karate. I mean, I wanted to do something which was, you know, just destroying and, uh, you know, nothing getting into, uh, you know, uh, doing something which is knowledgeable or something. I was always into destroying things. I remember when um, I told my dad that, uh, you know, Mujhe bhi Jackie Chan banna hai. He was like, okay. And he understood because, you know, I would always hit my brother here and there and I was all I would always look at the TV TV mein Jackie Chan ne aaj ye move kya hai. I should practice it I should be you know uh, I should be perfect uh, he took me for a class uh, we actually went for a karate class but uh, I think my destiny took me towards judo I'm a professional judo player also I have played internationally and um, we started doing judo now um, when I started, we were not, um, I mean, my family was economically not well, like how other sports person in India are. But uh, my dad, I mean, he could not even um, afford uh, class fees that time. But he never, he never told me anything. You know, I was, I was so dedicated, I, ju I just wanted to do it. So he was like, okay, let's do it. And he enrolled me and my brother both to the class. Um, we could only afford going one way to the class. I mean, uh, afford a transportation going one way. So at, at the age of, say, six, my brother was three. We used to, uh, from our school practice, we used to go to the class in a bus. And while coming back, uh, you know, my dad used to pick my brother on his shoulder. And uh, I would walk. And he used to give us moongfali or chana. You know, like chana logo ko strong banata hai, bache strong bande chana khaoge to, you know, you will become strong. So I used to eat chana and walk. And now what happens is, now when, uh, you know, when you're, you are into rigorous practice for two hours at such a small age, you don't feel like walking. You, you are just, ke please mujhe utha ke koi leke jau. It was uh, like that. And uh, <coughs> just to, you know, uh, divert my mind that you know I'm I'm not uh, I'm not tired or something he would uh, you know tell me Jackie Chan stories that if you're not eating your chana well if you're not walking if you're not being strong Jackie Chan will get angry on you he calls he calls me every day he asks what's Hetal doing in the class so it was like okay fir aur, aur kuch pucha mere bare mein. And you know, every time when I'm in the class, I would want to do good and want to practice more hard that, you know, Jackie Chan is feeling good about me. 
and he is he is you know he is okay he is satisfied that yeah she is doing good and uh, i don't know why but <clears throat> you know that kept me you know it's it likes it keeps keeps you moving that you have something like if my dad would tell me ke nahi beta hamare paas paise nahi hai hum nahi ja sakte you have to walk we used to walk 3 kilometers from the class to home after 2 hours of rigorous practice and at the age of 6 and these these small small stories that my dad used to say this, it would you know it would take me home every day so this is where you know uh, uh, how do i put it every sports person goes through a struggle i would say sports person because i know i know only about sports so i am you know focusing only on sports now oh, uh, after growing up after doing judo i came into sumo wrestling <coughs> now sumo wrestling happened to me ekdam achanak se i mean i we used to do sumo but we never thought okay you know we never saw any girl playing it and uh, uh when you know there were guys coming to our club and they were practicing we used to i used to practice with them and five out of three i mean three out of five four out of five i used to win sometimes so that got my you know that caught my interest that you know even i should play if i can win here i should you know i can stand somewhere at least at the uh, at the tournament so i asked my coach if i could go ahead and he said yes you can but you will have to find a sponsor for yourself i said what is a sponsor why do i have to find a sponsor because for judo we uh, you know government used to do everything for us he said because this game is still not government recognized it's still not in the olympics so you will have to bear, bear all your charges i mean everything that you uh, you have you're doing you will have to bear for everything from from the scratch from going traveling and everything i said okay and uh, for the first tournament i couldn't find any sponsor so i ran out of the house ki jab tak mujhe koi sponsor nahi milega i will not come and come home and i went it to each and every person personally i used to go sit at their office sit at the reception wait full day wait for 2 3 days to meet the uh, meet people it's like it's just because this game is not known in india how many of you knew that there is sumo wrestling in india happening no one still people don't know and you know if you type hetal dave on google you will find hundreds of interviews hundreds of interviews come from you know not just in not just from india all over the world but it's just that in india maybe people are not uh, you know, i mean this game is not exploring that well people are not getting to know about it you know just ba- breaking the stereotypes like how uh, sir said um i always wanted to you know break the stereotype why i come from rajasthan from a very conservative marwadi family and uh, marwadi girls are not even allowed to study uh, uh, i mean in colleges or you know in rajasthan people still don't allow girls to get out of the house and work or you know study more if they want to get you know you can not even go to the hostels and stay there and study and i took up sports now my community here also were uh, not okay they were not that supportive at the start but now when you know people know about me when you there are there are people who know about me as well in india so you know when they come to know when they uh, when they read my stories or when they listen about me now they are happy that nahi abhi hamare community ki ladki kuch kar rahi hai but when i went for a help tabhi nahi nahi hamare community ki ladkiyan ye sab nahi karti ab ghar mein raho stitching sikho cooking sikho why why a girl can't get out of that stereotype and do something else why are you not allowing her to you know just show off what she can do what she is interested in doing and why just go in one lane yehi rasta hai ghode ke jaise seedha 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 chalte jao get married have kids okay or done why why can't we do something different i am you know i am over age to get married in my community now people ask my uh, my, my parents abhi tak ladki ki shaadi nahi ki 
कितनी बड़ी करके शादी करोगे लड़का ही नहीं मिलेगा तो वाई आई मीन इज इट इम्पॉर्टेंट इज इट इम्पॉर्टेंट टू गेट मैरिड इट इज नॉट इट इज सीरियसली नॉट इफ यू आर नॉट इफ यू डोंट वॉन्ट टू आई मीन इफ यू कैन टेक केयर ऑफ योर सेल्फ आई वुड इफ आई कैन टेक केयर ऑफ माई सेल्फ आई वुड आई वॉन्ट एनी बडी एल्स टू टेक केयर ऑफ मी या इमोशनली यू नीड सम वन इमोशनली यू नीड सम वन टू यू नो बी दे विथ यू सपोर्ट यू बट इट्स नॉट कंपल्सरी दैट अ गर्ल हैज टू गेट मैरिड एंड एट अस एट अ एज यही लिमिट है इसमें शादी नहीं किया तो शादी नहीं होगा इट्स 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 वॉट इट इज सेड so i decided that uh, you know the struggle i went through i went door to door finding sponsors i went you know talking to people telling them everything explaining them everything when i meet new people uh, when i meet guys now you know for marriage thing because mai bahut buddhi ho gayi hu for marriage so now when i meet them you know what they'll ask what so okay so what do you do uh, okay i'm a sports person ओ अच्छा 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 तो स्पोर्ट्स में क्या करती हो सुमो रेसलिंग ओ कुश्ती करती हो वेरी नाइस ओके कुश्ती कर एंड देन फ्रॉम द नेक्स्ट डे फोन इज ऑफ वाओ दैट इज माय इंपैक्ट एंड आई लव इट ऑनेस्टली आई लव इट बिकॉज आई वांट समबडी स्ट्रॉगर देन मी यू नो नॉट जस्ट फिजिकली बट इमोशनली एंड मेंटली ऑल्सो यू शुड I mean, why? Why can't you accept a girl doing sumo wrestling? I mean, I mean, I'm not just. अगर मेरे कोई मुझे मिला है, I'm talking. तो मैं क्या? I'm not going to jump in and start fighting with him. Of course, no. I, I mean, I'm not mad. And you know what people will say? Oh, you're a sumo wrestler, so I have to be scared of you. You can hit me any time. Why? Am I mad? Why would I just come and hit you, boss? so this is what people still think and these are educated people okay koi i mean not just anybody on the street people on the street are respectful oh you are a sumo wrestler maine padha tha maine dekha tha mummy maine aapko dekha hai maine aapka interview dekha hai you know i have seen i have given interviews in marathi also i mean i'm very bad at it and you know the, i have met people Randomly people coming. Oh, be tum cha interview paila hota. I was like, okay, thank you. But apko kuch samjha because my Marathi is super stupid. Oh, tumi khub chhan bolle. I was like, thank you. So it is. I mean, you know, when you do something different, you feel so proud of you. You know, there are people. There are people who will discourage you. Of course, there are. there is a good side and a bad side to everything so there are people who will discourage you but there will be someone you know there will be someone who would come and tell you one good thing and you will be you know you will be smiling all day so yeah and um, i would also like to say that um, looking at my struggle now i started uh, you know working on people who are just strugglers like me like how i struggled to get a get through a sponsorship for a tournament so every tournament i have to go i have to find a sponsor so like that we start now i have started a, an academy we do freelancing okay so this academy is um where we support kids from uh, the you know the underprivileged or who who cannot afford to uh go for any sports tournament or something like that so what we do is we train people who can afford things get money from them and we give it to people who cannot afford so the struggle that i went through i don't want anybody else to go through it so we try on a very small base we have started so we try and support as many kids as we can recently one of my student uh, she doesn't have a father her mother is a tiffin banane wala uh, uh, you know they make idlis and uh, the breakfast that you get on roads so she does that and this student is now a national champion she has uh, she is 
first in Mumbai, first in Maharashtra, and now will be soon first in nationals also in India. So yeah, we do something like this, and um, that's it. I would just want to conclude saying uh, I couldn't I couldn't tell you my full story, but I will surely do that sometime. But I would like to conclude saying just forget what everybody else around you wants to you know comment on you or wants to tell you something or wants to you know put things on you just do whatever you want do whatever you like just close your eyes and do whatever you want to do just feel the the good that you get from that thing and every everything else around it will fall on place and it has to fall on place when you are faithful towards what you want to do so that's what i did and with with the full support of my parents my family since coming from rajasthan a very conservative family my parents were always supporting of me taking any decisions that i wanted in life say i mean i decided of doing something which is different at the age of 6 and then at the age of 18 when you know in a marwadi community you need to get married when you are 18 or 19 so um, yeah thanks a lot kagas for having me here thanks a lot everybody for sitting and listening to it i hope you have related to my story and um, um, would see you soon thank you <laughs>